That's the upper intake for a J-Series Honda V6. That's the throttle body. It's actually upside down. But what I wanted to show you is that there is two coolant lines that go into the throttle body. You can see it right here. One, two, they're five sixteenths. And these things get old and brittle and crack over time. So what I like to do, I actually live here in Southern California. It doesn't get all that cold. So what I usually do is I just take those lines out that send coolant through the throttle body. And I understand why it takes place in, in colder climates where it snows or the rust belt. They want that throttle body to get nice and warm as quickly as possible in the OBD2 system to go into a closed loop so it's the most fuel efficient in the closed loop system. Here in California, it really doesn't make that much difference. So I actually cut these lines because I had to do a valve cover gaskets, spark plug tube seals, adjusted the uh, glass on the intake and exhaust valves. But uh, what I want to show you is I just cut these off, right? And you guys can do the same thing. And then right down here, it's actually a loop that I did. So here you can see one of the new hoses that I put on. 5 16 hose and the other one is right there right so i just bypassed the throttle body altogether just fed it and if you really wanted to you could just take the hose come up here and then stick it right back into there you don't even have to go through this line because it goes into a metal line right here you could just bypass that metal line altogether if you really wanted to but i just didn't have a hose that did a loop like that so that's why i just ran a new line here a new line here these lines have never been changed and this vehicle is what some 20 years old the valve cover gaskets had never been changed i don't even think there'd ever been a valve adjustment on this as well maybe there had but uh yeah i just want to show that to you like i said this thing is sitting upside down because i wanted to show you that i'll just bypass the uh throttle body so there you guys go a quick tip from bunny's garage for your honda j-series v6s